Now let's go ahead and find the volume of this box that we have here. So we're given some dimensions and we're given the volume equation. So our first step is we're going to label our sides length, width, and height. And really it doesn't matter which way you label them, but for the sake of this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out my height here. My tallest piece is going to be 9, so my height is going to be equal to 9 centimeters. I'm going to do my length here as 10 centimeters. And then I'm going to do my width is six centimeters. So the way, the reason why I do this first is it's gonna help me not only for volume equation, but also for surface area. So for volume, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do my length, which is, which is 10 centimeters. And I'm gonna multiply that by my width, which is six centimeters. And then I'm gonna multiply that again by nine, which is my height. So let's go ahead and do that in the calculator. 10 times 6 gives you 60 times 9 gives you a volume which is equal to 540 centimeters cubed.